Hello viewers, this is Oklahoma Bridges and I'm sitting in front of the 1926 Kohler and Campbell um, player piano here. It's not restored, it's 100% original. It's had a little bit of repair work as you saw by the previous, previous video where I was doing some patchwork on the main reservoir bellows. Everything else is original except for some of the rubber hoses. And this is going to be the first time since 1963 that this piano has played a this role. This was the role that was on the piano when I bought it. So I want to dedicate this uh, playing of this role to the family of the um, previous owner of the piano. This is the first time that the piano in its original um, state has played a role since 1963 and I'm going to leave it in its repaired original state for a year or two and then I'm going to do a full restoration on it and um, this uh, piano is going to be electrified with an electric um, pump to make it more friendly for uh, demonstrating at the steam engine show here at Pawnee, Oklahoma. And um, this roll has a few rips in it, but it plays okay. Let's see if I can keep up with the pumping enough to make it all the way through the performance. And let's just sort of walk around the piano here and take a look. There's the gearbox that's been cleaned and all polished up. And there's the air motor. All of the lead tubing that goes from the tracker bar down to the valves. The automatic tracking device. And of course the valve chest there that you've seen apart in some of the other videos. And then down underneath we have the foot pumps and the, the pumping bellows and then the large reservoir bellow that you saw me patching in the previous video. So we're going to uh, operate this piano here. I've got the controls all connected up. This is the re-roll and play control. As you can see, that's the functions that it does. And then there's the tempo control. And then there, I won't be using these in this performance, but there is the bass soft. And then there is the treble soft. You can't see it because it's behind the air motor there. And you can see the keys dip. There's where the brake is right there between E and F above middle C. And then I don't have the automatic sustain hooked back up yet, but that's what What's labeled loud here is the manual override on the automatic sustain and then there's a switch here in the player compartment that allows you to have the choice of either manual or automatic sustain. Like I said, that's not connected at this point. After I get the air pump, that'll all be hooked up and I'll show how it works. So here we go. Uh, this is the Blue Dan U Waltz played by Lee S. Roberts, QRS Roll 160-124.
say one of these when they're fully restored um, pumps about as easy as taking a walk and uh, I'll look forward to that anyway let's rewind this and thank you for watching